Hello guys and welcome. I hope that you are well. My name is I play 4K, aka I play 8K, aka I play 16K or UGD King. During this video, I'm going to show you a valuable detailed video how much Titan RTX or RTX 2080 Ti video card, single video card can mine of Bitcoin in the March. Uh, 19 2021 in terms of the megahertz speed and income okay as you can see i have two rigs and this rig is running on a monitor connected to the titan rtx pretty much titan rtx or uh, rtx 2080 ti video card by nvidia during gp architecture will be mining the same rate which will be uh, stock 55 megahertz per second and keep in mind this is the complexity difficulty level of the march 19 2021 and right now as you can see it's 62.42 mega hash per second okay it's running through the excavator uh 1.6.7 c i'm recording this video today with the iphone 10r uh, running my iphone ipad 4k resolution video recording method which is 170 megabit per second 17 times about 17 times higher than apple allows you so video is crystal clear as you can see this computer uh, is pretty much running non-stop mouse is not connected to it and there is no application is running on the background so this is the healthy so the maximum what you can achieve on the titan rtx or rtx 2080 ti video card running dual fan design without water cooling will be 62-63 mega hash per second at this current difficulty in the march 19 2021 in the end of this video i'm going to show you the difficulty uh, ratio value okay and here is the date what i'm doing right now this is my sample but i just joined the u.s mining team uh, you can mine through any kind of client. This is the best client to mine. The best way to do it through the nicehash.com. But I'm doing it through the uh, private client. Keep that in mind. So I'm accepting the Bitcoins to my private wallet. Okay. So uh, this is the value. 62 megahash per second. This is the maximum overclock on air value. Which is GPU you want to bring to minus 500, 400 megahertz so you can overclock your vram because the vram on the titan rtx or rtx 2080 ti video card which is the turing gpu architecture by nvidia ggr6 is pretty much the key to receive the highest mega uh, mega hash per second um value of computing of the speed and it's plus 1100 under the msi after burner under the vram and minus 500 megahertz on the gpu which even zero uh, or plus 100 megahertz additional on the GPU not going to give you any uh, mega hash per second but 1100 megahertz on the VRAM going to boost it up 7 mega hash versus the stock so it's jumping from 55 all the way to 62 mega hash per second non-stop but uh, Bitcoin mining required the video card if you're going to connect another video card and connect monitor to it you're going to be up at about 63 mega hash per second dash 64 mega hash per second okay but monitor right now connected to the hdmi port to this titan rtx but you can also do some workouts let me show it to you and uh, browse the internet do the video encoding through the cpu and right now as you can see there is a youtube playing on the background Plus, I'm encoding through the Sony Vegas uh, some uh, stalker uh, anomaly video for you in 4K resolution. And this is the beat rate. Okay, about 55 megahertz per second, just like Titan RTX running stock. But Titan RTX is not running stock. And pretty much, I'm utilizing the CPU through the Google Chrome browser and a little bit of the GPU. But if you're going to include Google Home only CPU utilization, your mega hash will be at 58, 59 mega hash per second. Keep that in mind. You're going to lose about 3 mega hash per second, but if you're going to completely full and not touch it, just work through the Google Home as it is, 
it's going to drop down by about 7 megahertz so pretty much your overclock will bring the megahertz at stock while you're going to operate and doing some computing and at the same time as you can see I'm doing the video encoding at the same time but I'm using the video encoding CPU algorithm okay as you can see okay so I'm not utilizing the video card so it is what it is guys and uh, this is the speed so let me show you real quick let me show you real quick guys the um, the difficulty level of the Bitcoin mining in March 2021 this is the difficulty level the next level will jump in in April 1st and the speed will drop down by about 10 percent on a Titan RTX or RTX 2080 Ti video card and let me show you pretty much what's the rate so Titan RTX is as fast as RTX 2060 Ti video card so the best video card in 2021 will be NVIDIA RTX 3090 at 120 megahash per second as you can see uh, then AMD Radeon this will be nice 80 megahash per second then RTX 2080 will be 98 megahash per second so pretty much RTX 2080 is the king between the megahash per second and the price but the best video card for the mining by nvidia will be rtx 2060 ti because it's going to show you 60 megahash per second just like titan rtx just like rtx 2080 ti or just like rtx 2070 okay this is what it is all right so this is so here's the value guys single titan rtx mining um right here 24 hours as you can see at the value of bitcoin a little bit over 58,000 per each bitcoin 58 dollars you want to sell it right now you want to wait and hold till it will be a uh, 1 million dollar per bitcoin so you can multiply the value per each 24 hours by 20 or by 25 times and then sell it that means that each day will be around 300 dollars okay this is one rig titan rtx and without the cpu and this is the second rig titan uh, rtx two of them actually twelve dollars fifty cents uh at the value of fifty eight thousand two hundred seventy eight dollars per bitcoin okay as again you want to uh, sell them you want to hold them as much as you can till the bitcoin value will reach one million dollars so you can sell it uh, and about uh, 24 hours will cost you cost them whoever will purchase the bitcoin around 300 dollars because you got to multiply the six dollars uh by 20 okay so it's going to be 120 dollars just single titan rtx per day per 24 hours or at uh, 12 dollars by 20 it's going to be around uh 240 dollars for two titan rtx's if you're looking or interested to find out how much xeon e5 2697 v2 or xeon e5 2699 v3 or two xeon e5 2699 v3 cpus are mining which is not recommended but with a lot of cores with 72 logical cores stick around over the hdking.com website smash that like button and i'm going to share it with you as well thank you so much for watching a lot of time money energy was invested don't forget to smash that like button so more people can can see such a valuable video about the titan rtx and subscribe and i will see you guys till the next video stay safe till the next time